Isn't it tragic that there are folk in the house of God but have never connected to the God of the house? Isn't it ironic that there are those who are in the right place to receive honor but are rather quite content being dishonorable? They are not vessels of honor, though they are in an honorable place. They are not vessels of honor, though they are in an honorable place. And may I say that there are folk in honorable positions that are themselves dishonorable? It's going to hurt just a little bit. I mean, there are deacons and trustees and preachers and pastors and leaders who are in honorable positions. They call themselves chairman and president and CEO and supervisor and boss. And yet! Uh, they are still dishonorable. They are in honorable positions. No, maybe not here at Central, right? Maybe not here at Central. But there are a whole lot of churches across this country that got folk in honorable positions but are yet dishonorable. And the only reason they're still in the position is because we don't honor the person. We honor the position. And as we honor the position, then automatically flows back down to the person. And so somewhere along the line, we got to understand just because you possess the title does not mean you got the traits. Did you hear me? It is not honorable for a person to be in an office and have not the internal composition that is required of it. Oh, I had so much more to tell you about that, but I got so much more to say. Because here's the deal. The text doesn't say they have no use. They are of some use. These dishonorable vessels that somehow got into the great house. It doesn't say they have no use. It just it says they have some use. And even in the church, there are some dishonorable pieces that serve a purpose, even if that purpose is nothing more than to stir up some stuff to keep up a ruckus so that the true saints in the house then don't get too comfortable because there's some folk running around, always starting trouble and always starting up some mess. And somewhere along the line, you you got to understand that they have some purpose, uh, even if the purpose uh, is to make sure that we who are in the house that are true saints of God don't get too comfortable, don't get at ease, uh, and don't become relaxed in our walk with God, but keeps us on our toes before the master.